now in this lecture i'm going to introduce you to a term called middleware and let me actually just spell that out so i'll come down here i'll add a comment and i'll call it middleware now what is a middleware essentially eh, to be very simple a middleware is just a function that does something that's what a middleware is but we cannot just leave it at that so if you come to this our post route that goes to this url between this route here this url route and this callback function we can slot in another function here and i'm going i'm actually going to create a function i'll call that function logger right i've not created a function but i'll call the function logger when i create it and i'll slot in the function here now let me come up here and create the function so just after this middleware text i'll create an arrow function that i'll call logger and essentially and what i want this function to do is just log something to the console so i'll i'll say print to the console and then i'll just say middleware run as simple as that now that's not all though this middleware function has access to the requests of the request object of this route and also the response object of this route and it has option um, access to one more object that object is called next i'll show you so in this guy here that i created this function here that i created i'll give it the request object the response object and the next object so whenever you do something in a middleware function you need to call the next uh, function here and that is what will give permission to this callback function or whichever function is in front of this middleware to run so i'll come here and i will say next and then i'll call it so now remember this middleware we've slotted it in between this route url here and the callback function immediately this middleware function runs what's going to happen well just one thing we're going to have a console.log of middleware run and then the next function will be ushered in which is our callback function now this example looks very trivial like what's the importance of just logging logging something to the console it's just a foundation for us to understand what a middleware is a middleware is a function that can be slotted inside of this our route now let's go ahead and save and let me come here and fire off this um request one more time all right great so i'll fire it off and voila so you see here we get something in our console middleware run and then we get this undefined which is a problem that we are going to solve very shortly so now i'm going to bring up um something in my browser and it's a documentation on expressjs.com it just tells us what a middleware function is so it says a middleware function uh, it says middleware functions are functions that have access to the request objects and the response object and the next function in the application request response cycle so that's essentially what we just saw here we've been able to see that we can have access to the request the response and the next now but we've not demonstrated like we've not demonstrated that we actually have access to maybe this request for example so you know what i'll do after this console.log of middleware run i'll come to the next line and do another console.log and i'll just say request.method okay so i'll log that to the console and so now let's go ahead and save this file and let's fire off this api request one more time all right so i'll fire it off one more time and as you can see we have middleware run which is this guy here then we now also have the request method which is a post request remember this is the route we are firing it's a post request and that's why we have that here so essentially i'm just trying to demonstrate to you that this middleware function has access to the request and even the response of this route we created here 
So essentially, that's what a middleware is. Now, there are custom middleware that come with Express as a framework. Remember, the problem we're trying to solve is to get the request.body. And for that, we're going to need a custom middleware that Express provides. All right, so I'm just going to come here. I don't need this logger here, right? I just used it to explain what a middleware is. That's a function that has access to the request, the response, and the next object, and that can be slotted inside of our routes. Okay, so which um, express middleware we're going to use one express middleware to solve this problem so that we can access the body of information that is coming with our request and the name of that middleware is so i'm just going to come and say app dot use and then i will specify the exact middleware that i want in this case it's express dot json so remember this data that we are sending um in the body of our request is a json data this express middleware here custom express middleware is going to help us to be able to interpret that data and get access to it so for now i'll just you know get rid of my logger i'll just comment it out and at some point i'll just delete it altogether. so let's remove that here as well and then i'm just going to save now let's fire off this our request again for our post request so i'll fire it off and watch what happens voila so you see now because we've added this express middleware we now have access to the data that we sent from the body so you see in our console.log we now have the name and task one which is what is coming from this our body here so you see that's just what the express middleware does in this case all right thank you so much for watching this one i'll see you in the next one